Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. A quick video with my purchases. I just want to show you some of the yarn that I've got from Sheer Delight. It's a website, I will pop it down below. I've bought um, the Cheviot yarn that I dyed with avocado in, I think it was like last year, that I bought some Cheviot, like undyed and I dyed it with avocado and I made a pair of socks, like house socks. I will pop the, um, the link of that video down below of the socks and of my previous uh, order that I've done with them. And I just, I just wanted some really unique wool. And since I've ordered my Cheviot last year, or maybe two years ago even, yeah, I think it must have been two years ago, They've expanded and they have a lot more yarn and a lot more um, fleece that they work with. And it came in this beautiful, beautiful canvas bag and it has a sheep on it that says Sheer Delight. And I already made one um, skein into a cake and it's this one. So uh, it's Lake District Fiber, Fiber Farming, uh, Sheer Delight. The colorway is Athena and it's a combination of Tees Water Gotland and Blueface Leicester. It's a four ply natural color, pure British wool. It's from the 2018 wool clip and it has 350 meters, 380 yards per 100 gram. And uh, I will link everything down below if you would like to have a look at the yarn. It came in a beautiful skein. I put it in a cake and this is what it looks like. It's very soft but still quite woolly. And it's very fluffy, very uh, puffy. And it has a little bit of a halo. I don't know if you can see it. And it has different shades of yarn in it. it it even has a little bit of um, dark gray hair in it you can't I don't know if you can see it but the base is like an off-white with some uh, speckles so um, I'm looking forward to creating a pattern for this I'm thinking to make a one skein scarf so a lightweight lacy scarf that it still keeps you warm, but also it's very light and fluffy and soft. So um, that's what I'm thinking of making with it. So it will be quite small because it's only one skein that I'm going to use. But I think I'm going to use a bit bigger needles so the, the yarn will be fluffier. So I'm going to put this back ready for me to cast on sometime soon. This is how I like to keep um, at the weekend because it's only at the weekend that I have time. I put my yarn into cakes, I put the labels on it and then throughout the week if I get a little bit of time then I cast on on something. <laughs> so that is that one. And then I also bought a cake of Sheer Delight. Um, which one is this one? Dogson Wood Product. Yeah, uh, here we go. Uh, Castle Milk Moritz, Moritz Blue Fest Leicester. It's a DK weight and it's a natural color. 100% pure, pure British wool from the 2017 wool clip. It's very, very soft. And as you can see, it's kind of like a brown color. Let's see if I can take this off and you can have a look at it better. There it is. It's like brown and as you can see it's, it's very woolly and very sticky. But I'm really excited to make something with this. It's 100 grams as well and it's 220 meters, 248 yards. yards. So I'm either going to make a pair of um, slippers slipper socks with it or maybe a pair of uh, mittens and then I've got two skeins of this one which is Teeswater and Castle Mill Moritz Morit Morit 
I think, I don't know how to say it. It's 110 meters per 50 gram skein. So I got two of them in order to um, have enough to make a pair of mittens or a pair of socks uh, with this is the same, very fluffy, very woolen. It even smells nice like wool. It's beautiful and it's very soft. This is the 2016 wool clip. And then I also got this one, which is softer. What's this one? Oh, it's just Castle Blue. If you go on their website, they tell you all about the um, sheep they have on the farm. They're quite rare breeds of sheep that they have. And it's, it's you don't, I mean, I've never even known Castle Blue exists. But when you touch it, it's so soft. It's so soft. This one is a double, double knit as well. And the same is the same as this one. Uh, 110 meters, 124 yards. And this one is a 2018 wool clip. So this is what I've got. I've got that for a pair of socks or a pair of mittens. I've got this for a pair of socks or a pair of mittens. <laughs> mittens. I've got this one for a pair of socks or a pair of mittens. And I bought this one um, for a shawl or a scarf. And it's, they're all undyed and they're all natural colors. And I really, really love them and I can't wait to um, use them. So if you would like to see what I'm going to knit with these, please follow me on Instagram uh, at Tell Makes. I usually post there or on Facebook I have a group tell makes and also here on youtube if you subscribe to my channel then i will update you on what i'm knitting on and what i use for all my knits and all my creations but that is it for now thank you very much for watching i will see you in my next video actually good i remembered when i placed this order i also bought a hand salve from the same this is the soap dairy is the same people but they have sheer delight for the yarn the soap dairy for natural soaps and shampoo bars and all kinds of skincare and I've already used this one a little bit It's very hard it's like a lot harder than a than a lip balm but what I do is I scrape it with my nail and then I spread it all all over my hand but is so nice it's so nice and my hands has be, have been so dry from all this washing with the whole coronavirus um, but this really helps it doesn't smell but it doesn't smell of anything but it has a smell of balm <laughs> let's see the ingredients marshmallow oil lanolin shea butter aloe butter apricot butter carrot tissue oil Pumpkin seed oil, black currant seed oil, broccoli seed oil, borage seed oil, carrot seed oil, and vitamin E. That is it. That is all they've got in it and it's just gorgeous. And I love it. Yeah. Good I didn't forget to put this <laughs> in uh, this video. But that is it. Um, I will see you in my next video. Bye.